Hello everyone, and welcome back to Besiege. So today we're going to play that level, I think. And maybe more levels, depending on how far it will take me to solve this level. So we have those things. And tornadoes. Okay, I, I don't know why I did that. Let's build a car that won't be lifted up by the tornadoes. So it will have to be pretty big. Because I'm going to have propellers underneath. On these wheels, I think. Let's see here. Maybe like that and that. Let's see. Yeah. That won't do it. Yeah, that won't do it either. Let's delete these. And move them out one more. I would like to have a maybe. Hmm. I could have it like that and have them closer together. Yeah, probably do that instead. But it makes it a bit smaller. And smaller means that it will be easier to maneuver. Will it fit in between here? Yes, it will. Good. And of course, I'm going to place the weights here because they are st sturdier, I think. So they can handle more weight and stuff. Hey, I placed it on the wrong place. Good. We, we will also need wheels. Outside that area. So wheels out here. And probably down one. Let's see, where do we have them? Here. So down one. And then our wheels. Yeah, that looks pretty good. We're really, really wide. Let's see... That I need. Yes, connect. Connect. And right now I don't have any steering. So that's a problem, but... We can fix that. I won't make it go on land. This should be automatic. Automatic. And also this one should be flipped. And increase your speed to the maximum, I think. Like that and like that. And there we see it. The blades are pointing the wrong way on one of them. Now it's better. You see? Okay, it can lift us up. Us up. So we don't have enough downward force to stay on the ground. So let's increase it by the double amount. So double it, basically. I hope all of them... Okay, one of these are pointing the wrong way. Let's delete both and then place them back again. And then flip both. Flip and flip. Good. 200% automatic. 200% automatic. Are they both spinning downward? Hmm. Let's see. Let's turn these. Let's make them like one and one and these two and two and they should not be automatic. So they are lifting me up. That's wrong. These are going down. That's good. 
Down. Down. Good. Now I can make them all automatic. Good, now I'm for they, they are forcing me down. Let's delete some of these things to make it a bit cleaner. Just add braces here and here. Then I need to make it be able to like destroy stuff. But that's the next step. One thing at a time. First of all, make it survive to tornadoes. Secondly, make it be able to turn, I think. And after that, I don't know. Could have a two-point steering. Okay, yeah. So I could have steering that's like Y and Y and H and H and then U and J, J. I'm bad at English letters. So now I can drive forward. I can turn and turn and drive forward. Good. It's a bit clunky, but I can definitely do it. And that is not sucking me up. Good. So now we have a drivable vehicle that also can't be lifted by the hurricane. Now we just need something to destroy those. Hmm. What could we destroy them with? I'm just building this here to get a little point where I want it. Okay, where's the part? It's of course under flight as it always is. It would be good to have a like most used item tab. Because I use some parts a lot more than others. And then it would be good to be able to select them. Can I... Hello? Good. And that would also be good if they fixed. So I can easier place things where I want them. Because it's kind of important to place things where you want them in a game like this. Can still spin, that's okay and great. Now... What can we have on top there? We can have flamethrower, no, that's boring. We could have a rotating block. And then... One of these. Or rotating block that's... A block that can rotate and not a rotating block. And then just some pistons. Back and some pif pistons back. Okay. Psst. Opposite. Some pistons forward and some pistons backwards. H. Hmm. Interesting if we move backwards. Do we have, do we have more pistons on one side, maybe? Probably. And this one should be... Yeah, probably up and down because... Yeah, that works. No, it doesn't. I don't like it that the connections between some parts are so freaking weak. I wonder if it gets better if I do... Let's see, where is it? Is it here? Yeah, it is. One of these here. And then blocks those like that. I wonder if this makes it better.
It definitely did. That's a lot better. Oh. It's spinning on its own. Let's drive forward. Destroyed one. Okay, the arm is moving too fast when we are turning. So have it down to 10% maybe. Yeah, that's better. We'll also remove some of the stability problems. So that's good. Forward, turn. Oh. <laughs> I use the pistons on the same button as something else. So that's problematic. T for toggle. T. Good, all set. Good. T. And I should remember something. I should place down a camera block. That's a stable point, so let's have F there. So now, camera. Good. Awesome. Turning. And toggle it. We're here. Can we just smack it down, maybe? Go oh, the other way, other way, other way. Bam! Got it. Straightforward, more or less. Turn it a bit. Punch! Turn around a bit more. Drive. Whew. So it can lift us just a little bit, but not a lot. And we're kind of stuck. We have lost some rotors. But we might be able to hit these stones anyway from this position. No! It's too short. We can't hit it. Okay, then we need to try and drive down. We have lost most of our power. Okay, good. Awesome! We got it! <laughs> Almost our whole vehicle got destroyed, but we got it! Okay, let's see here. We need to save this thing because I want to. Let's name it 12. And here... We can't have this vehicle. Load... Car. Yeah, car. Good. I saw an interesting solution for this level. On Reddit, I think. And I want to see if I can recreate it. It was using two water cannons, I think, or something like that. Let's see here. Why? Okay, water. And of course, they need to be higher up. In a gem, more weight on the bank. Let's see, how tall do we need to be? Probably around here. So the lowest water cannon at that spot. Good. Low water cannon. And then we need our tall water cannon, maybe up here. Let's see, weaponry. Water cannon. 
and just wear ice foot braces from here and yeah like that okay we we need a bit more of a mat maybe a bit more of a mat as well a bit something like this good can we drive eh, not good but we could definitely drive Just adding a bit of weight on the back Just copying to get them to all the weight I want. Good. Here. Yeah, this won't work. We need it bigger. Probably up two more on this one and out one on both. So two more up and out one out one delete everything hello good and now weaponry water cannon okay good need just some small parts now Add them all in. Like that, and like that. Good. Good. Let's see, how will it look here? That looks pretty good. Height-wise and so on. We just have one problem, getting it to start, because I guess that this wouldn't get it to start, and it's not exactly working as planned. With infinite water, this could probably work, and I don't know how much water these have. Also, I'm um, not. Damn it. Oh. I wonder if I can do this. No. Stupid. Don't do it. Good. Do some more. Maybe I build, build it, let's see, up here, a better angle. The car is not that stable, it moves really fast, so it's hard to get it in the right position, but that worked! Awesome, I didn't know, or I knew that it would work, but I didn't know how precise you need to be. Poison the well. Okay. This should be easy, I think we can use this one. Load it up. Maybe, actually, exactly this one. Okay, we, why? Don't... Hit the evil things. Okay, is it... Do I need to click Y to grab something? Hmm. Auto grab, static. Okay, just. Just add a grabber here. I mean, like I thought it was on this thing. And then T for trying to grab. Good. No! <laughs> I did not want that to happen. Now it might be stronger and might actually be able to work like intended. Looks like it got a lot harder 
to control when I did that. So it definitely added some weight to it. And it's quite not noticeable. So let's add some counterweights to the base. They sh should work if they're here. It's in the middle. So no, no real problems. Delete that one and not press D. Okay, can't I build from, okay I can build from underneath good for some reason I thought I maybe couldn't and I could also have it here this looks pretty good and I can also increase the weight of all of these by quite a bit good but let's try this driving backwards have a bit of trouble turning but that's just a churning system for you. I think it's more effective if you have a churning wheels in the middle instead of outside, and I think this is, is a outside model. No! Grab hold! Good. Rawr, I'm going to po poison the well. Oh, it actually grabbed hold of one. So my first plan could actually work. I don't remember! Which one do I drop the poison with? Delete that one, that one, that one. No. That one, and that one, good. And this one drops, no! Undo. It drops bit with the. Good. Now I know all the controls. Turn over. And of course it removed a bit of weight from the front, but we can do it. We can do it. We're jumping a bit forward with poison, but it's okay. We can still drive. And I should definitely update this base, it turns a bit better. Because this is just awful turning. Yeah, definitely upgrade the base. So that is like that. This is okay, good. Good. Updated. Let's see how it turns now. Okay. It flips over. That's interesting. Let's delete the most outer ones here and see if that changes anything. How much do this weigh? The minimum amount. And let's increase the weight on these. Good. Good, so now they weigh a lot more. We lost the grabber. That's awful. It seems like our turning problems happen because we're moving off the ground. Basically. It's weird. Let's just rebuild and not use this and 
how is this turning? Really well. Good. Save. Yes. Overwrite. Good. So, what I want to do is have pistons here. Like that. A big tower. One out. A couple of down like that, maybe. Like that. And then a grabber. Where's the grabber? And of course a camera block on here. We need the grabber, it's under... Not black blocks, mechanical I guess. Like that, okay. H. Okay. So these should be toggleable, all should be toggleable. And Y. Good, and yeah, that works well. This should be all like that. Good. So I can press Y to drop it down to floor level, and H to get, get it up, and I can all do stuff like that. Good. I will need to increase the weight on the back side of it because it's a bit front heavy, and you don't do it by placing balloons there. But that would have the opposite effect that I want. So, bad idea. Don't do it. That should be good. Increase the weight and just do this. Good. And I don't like that you have trouble clicking on stuff from underneath. Okay, Y, F for camera. Good. Woohoo! And I've, the weight just fell off. I guess we were too heavy. Hmm. Interesting. So you can move the camera a bit when you're using the, that camera thing. Good. I can drive. Let's go here. Closer, slower. We lost our weight on the back, so we might fall over. We want to do this. Drive close. And then smack it down. Good. And then we have it remove F. Move the camera. We have it straight over the well, but actually has water in it. I wonder if it will splash if when I drop this. Yeah, it actually splashed. Oh, I need more poison in the well? I thought I only needed one. I was mistaken. Let's grab another one. Got one. Good. Driving back. And into the well. Hup. Hup. And drop it. Good. This will be all for me today. If you like this video, like it. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching. And this will be my next video. Okay. Like killing these cannons. So see you then.